Hello everyone and welcome to iBasiac, the channel to be for all your floor care news, views and reviews. Well today it's just a very quick one for you, we all like a quickie from time to time and this video is a quickie. Now where is the vacuum cleaner, I hear you ask? Where is this little vacuum that I'm going to be demonstrating? Well, it's here! It's a mini vacuum cleaner by a company called Command. This is a vintage but in the box machine dating from the early to mid 80s if memory serves me well. Well anyway, is this little battery operated vacuum cleaner going to cope with all the mess I'm going to throw down for it? Well, let's have a look shall we? Well here it is, the mini vacuum cleaner by Command. Its reference number is 30308. It's powered by two times 1.5 volt batteries, not included, and it was presented by Narco National Limited, St. Mary's Works, Kruna Road, Camberley in Surrey, and it was made in Hong Kong. So here it is. It's robust and versatile. Fingertip on-off switch, removable, washable, dust chamber. I think that's all we have to say about that. Oh no, there's some more, more writing on the other side. Convenient and compact, ideal for working surfaces, suitable for rugs and upholstery. Well, I was going to do a demonstration on this table here. I've not thought about using it on rugs and upholstery. I can't see it <laughs> being very very efficient for rugs, but anyway, I might get a little bit of carpet and uh, see what it's like. But let's open the box. It's a sort of a semi-unboxing. This has been out of the box before. I will reveal it to you now. Ooh, doesn't want to come. Come on. There we go. Oh, that's the back side of it. Here it is in a lovely, lovely orange colour. Mini Command, it says on it, on both sides. Got a little black on-off switch on the top. This little indentation, that's designed for you to hold it. I mean, it's quite small, you could hold it like that anyway, but this is the way you're supposed to hold the machine while guiding it over the dirt. I've put the batteries in ready. The batteries fit in this compartment here takes two C-sized batteries. So they go into there. Let's pop that back on. Now underneath the business end of the vacuum cleaner we can see a little gold label made in Hong Kong. Now of course you don't see very much that says made in Hong Kong anymore. It all says made in China doesn't it? Well not everything but Certainly little things like this would be made in China. You can buy little desk vacuum cleaners now. And of course they'll all be made in China. This one is quite quite good as far as build quality goes. You see the design of it, quite attractive. It's got uh, four swirly brushes. And that little black thing there, that's a magnet. So if you're using it on a desk and there's a few staples or paper clips about, the magnet should trap them before it gets into the fan which could of course damage the fan. You can just see the fan in there. If I turn it on you can see the fan rotating. So let's look inside. Now you can see the fan in all its glory. Ooh. So that of course creates the suction power of this little mini vacuum cleaner. And here is the dust collection container. It's got a mesh filter all the way around. So that's where the exhaust air vents out of the machine all the way around there. So obviously the dirt gets sucked into the central hole and the air is expelled out through the mesh. Now there's a little tray insert, so most of the dirt, obviously it's not very big capacity, most of the dirt should go under this, so this comes off, so that's where the dirt collects. You can probably empty it without removing that every time, depending on what sort of things you're picking up. 
you could just tip it out like that. But for this little demo, to start with anyway, I've got some little bits of paper that I've cut up. I'm going to spread it about and we'll just see if this little mini command vacuum cleaner will pick up the little bits of paper. Well, as you can see, I've spread all this paper on the top of this table here and I'm going to pass the mini vacuum cleaner by command through the centre of all this paper and we'll just see if it manages to pick everything up. We'll go for just one sweep initially. With my normal reviews, I at least give the machine two sweeps, one forward and one back, but I'm going to give this a harder test, I think. We're just going to go through it once and then we'll see if it leads a nice clean path on this dining table. So here goes. Switch on and let's get cleaning. Well, not too bad, I suppose. It has brushed some of the some of the paper has been brushed out of camera shot by these little brushes but it's not done too bad let's see if I can clean a bit more up using a more circular action Well, it didn't do too badly, did it? It managed to pick up mostly everything I put down for it. So let's have a look inside the dust collection container. There's a few bits stuck on the fan. Put those there. And of course, we can see some of the debris that it's picked up. We'll see if we can tip it out. Come on, oh, it's still more. There might be some trapped underneath the tray here. Let's just lift that off, have a look. I oh, know it's managed to empty mostly everything. A few little stray bits there. So it's not done a bad job. On a hard surface with small bits of paper. Of course, this isn't a, a vacuum that's meant to clean deep down, is it? No, this is just a little novelty item to keep on your desk. Pencil shavings, do people still use pencils nowadays? <laughs> but it would, de it would deal with pencil shavings, wouldn't it? Odd bits of fluff. Some stray sherbet from your sherbet dab or your sherbet fountain, if you were eating that at your desk in the 70s or 80s. Well, anyway, let's have a, another quick go. Anyway, I'll, I'll concentrate the dirt and we'll just finish this brief little video. We'll pick all the rest of this up, hopefully, using the Mini Command Vacuum Cleaner. Well, there was one stubborn up. Uh, <laughs> I spoke too soon. It's depositing its uh, business all over my table again. Hang on a minute. I, I daren't move it because I think some of the 
paper will. Oh, well, let's have a look. Oh, yes. Has it managed to remove it? Not quite. Anyway, there we go. That's the mini command vacuum cleaner. The ideal machine for all your desktop cleaning needs. There we go with its original box. So, just a quickie for me today. Thanks for watching. If you like this video and want to see more, please subscribe. I upload normally three times a week new floor care demonstrations, vacuum cleaners, carpet washers, occasionally the odd steam cleaner I might do a demo of. But uh, it's everything you need to know about the humble vacuum cleaner. Hopefully you'll find out a lot more on my channel. And of course, look back, I've got uh, a few hundred videos for you to peruse. So if your particular interest is in one machine, if you're interested in pneumatic Henry's, for example, or pneumatic vacuums, Vax vacuums, Hoovers, Bissells, Dysons, Mealers, Sebos, I cover a wide variety of different makes on this channel. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you soon.